hello student let's try to see this questions this is the question uh, 2.13 now what is the 0.6 ml of acetic acid have density 1.06 gram is dissolved in 1 liter of water so here the water is there student this is the solvent if you talk about solvent they are talking about 1 liter and what is the solute di dissolving student this one CH3CHCOOH but in the form of how much it is dissolving so D is equal to M by V so M is equal to D into V so mass if you are calculating density they have given 1.06 and volume 0 0.6 so how many gram it is going to be dissolved 0 0.636 0 0.636 gram so this is the what is student you can to say w2 and m2 if you talk about acetic acid student so it is the 60 gram per mole 60 gram per mole m2 how i calculated m2 see ch3 c double oh so carbon is there 12 plus 3 hydrogen 3 again carbon 12 plus 2 hydrogen 32 plus 1 hydrogen it is coming 60. Now they are saying the depression in freezing point observed for this strength of acid is this much. So delta Tf they have given how much 0 0.0205 degree C. Calculate the one half factor and the dissociation constant of acid. I and k a both they are asking so what you can do here delta t f is equal to i into k f into m this one i into k f into m so these things are there so you put the value here is delta t f how much 0 0.0205 i they are asking k f they have given student k f for water na k f for water we have to memorize 1.86 student Kf H2O student that is 1.86 Kelvin kg per mole. Now it is the change so degree Celsius Kelvin both will be same. Molality, molality means W2 upon M2 and here is the C student. They are talking about 1 liter uh, dissolving 1 liter of water. So if it is dissolving 1 liter density is 1. So mass will be also one student. See D is equal to M by V. So M is equal to D into V. D of water is 1. Volume they have given 1 liter means 1000 ml. So it will become 1000 gram. So here is 1000 and that is a gram. So in the kg it will again become the 1000. This will be cancelled out. So here again you put the value 0 0.0205 into i 1.86 into w2 value here they have we calculated how much 0 0.636 0 0.636 m2 value we have got 60 now i is equal to we can multiply 0 0.0205 multiply by 60 divided by what is student 1.86 multiply by 0 0.636 this is there now let us do the calculation student so dear students here you see point zero two zero five multiply by 60 divided by 1.86 divided by point six three six six three six so it is coming student i value 1.039 1 1.0397 0397 so i is equal to 1.04 round figure so one thing we got student um, now other things they are asking dissociation constant so dissociation constant for this case dissociation not association so it is the c alpha square 1 minus alpha this is the for dissociation constant of acid student now 
alpha we don't know so alpha is equal to how to calculate student i minus 1 n minus 1 so this is the acetic acid they are talking about student so it will ionize to give ch3 c double o minus plus h plus so n value is how much it is the two acetate ion and h plus ion alpha they are asking alpha i value we have calculated 1.04 minus 1 n value 2 minus 1 so alpha is equal to 0 0.04 upon 1 so this is alpha is equal to 0 0.04 this is so now you can put the value ka ka now you can calculate c alpha square 1 minus alpha c value molality we calculated student molality here uh, okay so molality required student molality concentration concentration molality so given mass upon molar mass divided by uh, that is the uh, mass of solvent in kg so v ml upon 1000 so given mass zero point here we calculated the mass uh, 0.636.636 divided by 1000 uh, molar mass 60 V ml that is 1000 ml they have already 1 liter they are saying so you can divide 0 0.636 divided by 60 so it is coming 0 0.0106 right student 0 0.01 06 so you can use the value now 0 0.0106 alpha value we already got 0 0.04 multiply by 0 0.04 1 minus alpha so 1 minus alpha 0 0.04 so you just multiply the numerator 1.696 10 power minus 5 and divided by 0 0.96 now again you solve it is coming 1.766 into 10 power minus 5 this is the mole per liter this is the ka now you can put in the round figure 1.8 into 10 power minus 5 this is going to be mole per liter so this is our required answer student so this is very simple thank you very much for watching